honor killing. All right, its name has become synonymous with giving children who are fighting for their lives a chance to just have some fun. Camp Good Times allows kids with cancer, as well as their families and siblings, to enjoy the summer camp experience free of charge. Much of the funding is provided by Cops for Kids rides around the province, and today the kids at Camp Good Times got a very inspiring visit from one of those police officers, a man who knows exactly what they're going through because he was there himself. Linda Aylesworth reports. Most of the year, Loon Lake in Maple Ridge is a peaceful wilderness retreat. But for two months in the summer, it comes alive. In July and August, Loon Lake transforms into Camp Good Times, where for 25 years, the Canadian Cancer Society has offered children with cancer and their families a much needed break and the occasional special guest. Everybody say hi, Scott! A number of things make Scott special. For one, he's an RCMP officer. For another, he's a cops for cancer cyclist. There's cops that ride for several, several kilometers and they raise funds. And some of those funds come directly to Camp Good Time. Several kilometers is right. Over a nine day period in September, Scott and his fellow Tour de Valley riders will cycle more than 800 kilometers through the Fraser Valley. Each has his or her own reasons for taking on the grueling event, and Scott is no exception. Scott actually used to be a camper with uh, Camp Good Times. He actually it's came awesome. to our it's team awesome. program. There are fives. I had a cancer called Burkitt's lymphoma, which was basically uh, a tumor that developed on my intestine. So um, I had to uh, go in for surgery to have that removed, and then subsequently go through chemotherapy. Strangers started staring at Scott when his hair fell out, eyebrows and all. An awful lot for a 13-year-old to handle, but at Camp Good Times, he could escape. He could just be Scott again. It's a place where you come and you get here and all the kids that are here know what you're going through. Uh, they understand why, you know, you look the way you do. 17 years later, Things really haven't changed much at all. It's a place where you can have fun where like when like you're you might be scared or like or just feeling sad. It's a place where you can have fun. It's just knowing that you have someone else that go has gone through the same thing as you and then it's just easier to share and I guess you kind of make friends because you're going through the exact same thing. Push down the button and the wires get hot. Yeah, to offer you. such an experience yeah, to a child is a wonderful thing. It's because of people like Scott and the generosity of the public that the Canadian Cancer Society can offer Camp Good Times free of charge. One of the things that keeps us going when we're, when we're climbing those big hills or you know putting in those hundreds of kilometers is, is knowing that at the end of the day, the ride is going to benefit some kid that really deserves it and needs it and uh, that pushes all of us to to push forward and get her done a kid like you yeah a kid like me yeah <laughs> the cops for cancer rides which take place in four regions of the province benefit cancer research as well as camp good times if you'd like more information go to our website and click on links in the news squire barnes and mike mccardle are still ahead and mark madriga